So this is book one, and then, so there must be book two, book three. Yeah, it's going to be three to complete the, the series, and uh, once the series is done, it'll be a, a film. So the uh, three books, 14 chapters to comprise the whole thing. Each chapter is kind of like a piece to the puzzle. It's a pulp story, so it's like, by the time you read the, the three books, you have all the pieces, and everything just kind of comes together really nicely, and you can appreciate it again, go back, reread it. I noticed there's a lot of like crosses and like devils and things like that. How did that tie into the story? Yeah, absolutely. Like it's it's very symbolic. It's so heavy and laid to with so much different symbolism. I always found crosses really beautiful and just the whole spirituality and like the alchemy. One of the main reasons it's called alchemy is because of the uh, alchemy is the process of turning base metals into gold. But I used it as a, a metaphor. Uh, just kind of for the people as they go from uh, impure people to becoming gold or just like hearts of gold or like get to that point where you're willing to sacrifice and do uh, uh, just sacrificial things for other people and just be, you know, gold. Oh, where did the idea of the story come from? Uh, uh, it's, it comes from a, a few different places. Like the the main reason, like for the story, the core story, is uh, follows a girl who's abused in high school and like kind of her degradation and her spiral out of control with drugs and all this stuff. But uh, th like it, you know, I just knew a lot of girls growing up who told me like the same version of a story. This is really sad story, and they all kind of had a similar past. And uh, you know, you just hear that enough times, and you just want to you just want to do something about it and, and tell a story that's going to be like. You know, just something that lets them know that, you know what, there's a lot of girls in the same boat as you, or, or guys too, but, uh, you know, you, what you're harboring inside that you think is such a big monster and it's so horrible, you know, isn't, you're, you're not so alone in that. There's a lot of people who have that past. It's a lot more common than you think it is. And I think it just takes a lot of the, uh, the hurt out of it once you expose that, you know? So telling the story is basically, initially was with that type of purpose in mind and it's evolved and it's become a lot more than that and and whatnot but that was kind of like the initial inspiration for the story i'd say yeah i'm joel abrahamson author of alchemy and that's the format <laughs>